Oh, hello everyone. I'm doing an unboxing right now. Unboxing? It's a package of opening. Anyway, I know what this is. I just cut it open and saw what it was, but I took out the, you know, the personal information stuff. Um, so let's see what's in here. I just love this, this jiffy bag. It's so cute. So I'm going to take everything out. Call that presentation. And oh yeah, it's the um I forgot what it was for a second. Um it's one of the decks from uh La Rose Des De Reeves. F follow her on Instagram, please. She's just amazing. She has Oh, it's a wish card. That's really cool. So you can write down what you want the universe to do. I think I'll do that at the end. This presentation now it's been ripped because of packaging and postal stuff but look at this like this is stunning there's a little bow here there's a sticker on it and we're just gonna oh there's something under here uh, oh she gave me a little note thanks so much for your order i'm so excited to send a deck to my ancestors homeland of ireland oh wow i hope it brings you so much love light and lots of positivity i love your instagram erica she is so sweet like that is like the cutest thing ever. i'm putting this in the background that's in the background i love unicorns hey i love unicorns believe you can and you are halfway there because you have to believe that you can do stuff rather than thinking you can't okay so let's get into this oh my god she came with, oh it comes with the book i didn't know it came with the book that was a pdf or something just just rip into it that's lovely ASMR stuff right there. Into the recycling bin. Well, I have a bin of paper and stuff. So. Wow, it comes with a, a book. I did not know it came with a book this big. Like, Oh, that's really sweet. Look at that. This is about each card. You don't see it, so it just tells you the words on it very simple and straightforward I love this galaxy rose it's so pretty that's really nice okay so we're, we're here for this really we're here for the deck so where's my scissors there's my scissors 42 card oracle deck and it's a positivity pack I've had this on my wish list on Etsy for a year maybe more and I was like oh when's the right time to get this and then I sold some decks and I went, do you know, that's on my PayPal now, I can use them. So there you go. I love when you're like, I can use this towards something. Rather than towards um, <laughs> stuff I already did pay for, so it's already been paid for some bits. All the little bits come in from the window. <laughs> so this is a, uh, I don't know if you call it a clamshell box i can't remember the type of box it is clamshells go like this but it's the top it's a box that goes like, i think it's clamshell this is clamshell it's quite nice actually very very sturdy holy crap like it's not even like a cheap little tuck box or anything it's like really um really well done i've had my eye on this deck for too long The little plastic wrap on it oh, oh wow there, there's no seal on them sometimes they stick so it's just like bending it a little bit so you kind of break the seal there's the backings i follow her on instagram so these are the cards i would like when you go this one or that one and she you pick the one you want and in the next few ones she goes if you pick this one she she's probably watching this going oh my god <laughs> you're mimicking me but yeah i'll talk through a few cards then I'll stop and then we'll just listen to a nice little flip through song. Through me, a flip through song. That's something. Ooh, sea magic in the mundane. Look at that. Aurora, Aurora Borealis. Dreams do come true. It's all about positivity. So it's about little positive things that you should take note of during the day. And look, that's the one. Everything happens for a reason. This is the one I would live by, this one. Inhale exhale very pretty 
she made this herself. I think she's she's done another one, an angel one, and she drew it herself. It's really pretty. But this is the one that's drawing to me more. Do not let others dim your life. Yep, even if you have like the negative toxic people around you are not the ones to be around. Life is magical. This is really nice. I love this font, by the way. Like, this font is really nice and readable. Like, it's... It looks like calligraphy, but it's nice. You know? Ooh. You matter. I love this. Like, it's a, it's like a lodge in the middle of nowhere. So even that one person who lives in the lodge out in the middle of nowhere in the mountains, they matter. Make a wish. I will. I have the card. I'll make a wish. <laughs> uh, Feel grateful. Gra feel gratitude. Not grateful, sorry. You are strong. From here, I think I'll go quiet now and we'll just listen to the video. that was really pretty like there's 42 cards here it's just as big as any oracle deck and it's just a nice size um size wise here i just have them what's it called uh dark darkwood tarot on hand here yeah it's no bigger it's just a little bit taller than a llewellyn deck you go over there <laughs> just out on the table because I want to work with it and it's just there settling in oh no it's just settling in give it a shuffle and so we'll do a quick reading we'll do a pick a pile actually this would be easier because we do pick a pile like in the last video it's such a nice feel to it it's not too slippery kind of like um Terrell did in the Wii. It's that kind of glossy. It's not too slippery though. Let's take this one. This one. And this one. Okay. Let you guys pick a pile there. So I pick one, two, or three. 
just cleanse your mind. Whatever one you're focused on, go for it. Okay, we'll go with number one here. Struggles bring strength. This makes sense, because if you succeeded all the time, you would not know what failure is like. You wouldn't learn anything. If we were, if life was like, you got all A's in, in school, you got all A's in college, you got the job straight after college, you got the promotion, you got everything. Everything went perfectly. You wouldn't learn anything. You wouldn't learn any life experiences. You wouldn't learn any struggles to be with um, certain things because where you get strength from and character is from those failures like you're allowed to fail otherwise how would you learn like you can you, most people would struggle with at least one subject in school or something and if you fail at that that's fine you can work on it to get a pass whatever but you acknowledge that you're not it's not your strength my strength isn't math i hate math i can't stand it but i have to learn it because you have to learn academic stuff but let's just see what um, Erica says in her book about struggles. Uh, let's see, struggles bring strength. What she's saying. It. I won't do the whole page, I'll do this little uh, synopsis here. The sun will always shine after the dark darkness of night. It will always get better, even if things don't go your way, see? Even if the worst, most heartbreaking things happen. Just know, at some point there will come a time where you will smile again. That's perfect. Like, that's beautiful. That is, that's really nice. <laughs> like, even though, like, I said it in, like, a career sense, but even in the sense of, like, losing a loved one or anything, it's, it's meant to happen. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's those things that are meant to happen or you're meant to learn those lessons, unfortunately, you know? So that's pile, that's Chris card one. Let's see what card two is. Life is magical. We got life is magical. Life is magical. Even though this like crazy chaotic time is happening right now, um, life is magical. Like this is a reason. There's things because the world paused, and things were seen for their true colors, and the the fog was lifted and stuff. So life is magical. I'm gonna see what it says in the book for what Erica wrote. Life is magical. Life is so magical. We are so blessed to be alive. We're so blessed to experience all the magnificent planet, <laughs> all this magnificent planet has to offer. As children, we see the world as magical. All we do is play and fun. That's so true. But then somewhere along the line, we're programmed to believe that life is hard. We have to do things we don't like. Money is hard to come by. Traveling is for the rich. Work is stressful and hard. Even love fades over time. That's in like quotation marks. But these are all lies. People see things, see these things happen because that's the way. What? Wow, that's what they believe is true. Whatever you believe to be true will occur. So do so. Do you really want to believe in all these negative things? Hell no. She goes hell no. <laughs> so yeah, like. Maybe this is more a sign saying work with your inner child, work, do some meditation as well in that sense. But definitely what Erica said, like those negative, we're programmed to be part of society rather than going, well, you don't have the money. You can't go to Spain. No, you can't. You don't have the money. You can't do this. Well, you, you can't. You have to get money because work is hard. But work can be fun. Do you know? All right. So that's group two. So card number three, we have seek adventure oh come on like with those two there seek adventure like when this all goes away i think everyone's gonna be back traveling that's gonna be the main thing everyone's gonna be traveling so much when those planes and all this vaccine stuff is done with because it's crazy like okay you crave a way out this is what it says in her book of the dull programmed regime of life and there's no there's one answer to that sneak adventure travel to a place you've always dreamed of going i've actually wanted to go to japan and korea or if the funds or if the funds or the time isn't available right now explore new parts of your own city or the nature nearby there's parts of ireland i've been to like when i was younger um we did the whole coastal areas when i was younger from 
year for years we did road trips but there's bits I wanted to see because now I'm older I want to see the history bits or the um the historical yeah I just want to see all the history that our country has like I went to the nat- natural history museum with a cousin a year or two back and I learned so much about Ireland in that trip than I have in the years I've been to them because when you're a kid you want to play you want to go on the beach and mess and play and be a kid but when you're an adult you want to learn and learn things about your culture and everything so seek adventure in your own country that makes sense like you know like go to play a state if you're in america go to a state you haven't visited before um or go to some place in your country you haven't ever been to like it's crazy like there i remember only last year i have never been to this one part of dublin and i went there and it was brilliant i've never been to blanche and i was like it's called blanche's town but it was a huge shopping centre I went, why have I never been here? Because I'm always on the other side of the city. So it just makes sense, you know. So yeah, seek adventure. Guys, I think that's a lovely reading right there. I'll leave that there and I thank you so much, Erica, for this. This is just a beautiful card and I'm glad I could help you out with your little business because, you know, in these trying times we need to help each other uh, more than ourselves and... I hope you're safe and well always and um, I'll leave it there. So 